Hey y'all, like, I don't know if I should feel bad telling you this, but it's, no, it's good news. I'm in Wilcox's book. Like, I just don't know if I should break it to you because it's like part of the last thing, but it's just truth. So he wants me to spread it. And he didn't figure it out. Anyway, he just tied it into something else, which was original. Anyway, the Sumerian tablets had a number, 195-955-200, and then six more zeros. So, um, this guy named Chatelaine uh, discovered that it was 16.2 million years in seconds. Like, weird, huh? The exact amount of seconds. Um, you know, if there's 86,000... Um, no, there's 8,640 seconds, I think, in a day. Uh, but anyway, but what's crazy is that Chatelaine divided it by um, the processional number, and it was exactly 240 cycles. The processional number was 9.45 million days each. Anyway, you should just watch it yourself. It's, I mean, read it yourself. Okay. Um... It created like this see-through brain on these mice so they can do it to us now and literally see in our brain. I'll just give you the, the picture because uh, the link because the picture is so crazy. Um, hopefully Apple is going to be doing solar <clears throat> technology with the batteries and shit. And I really think that <clears throat> the exact day that the Texas fires were going on, the fucking solar flare went crazier than ever, as usual. But, like, it's obvious, obvious proof. I mean, what's going on? But I was here, and that same day was actually quite cold. It was the first cold day. So something about the dryness and the heat at the same time. And also, um, on better news, um, Thomas Penchon, uh, he specifically released Gravity's Rainbow, uh, February 28th in a sign of Pisces. So, uh, because it's a sign of disillusionment, and mysticism, and shit like that. But I don't think he knows, but he probably did, um, that it was also the year of the ox, which was what he was, which also means Jupiter was in the same place as it was Capricorn when he was born. Because it's also kind of a 12 year cycle. So, I just think that's kind of tight. Uh, he probably knew about it. And I'm good. I can't wait to get the companion guide to Gravity's Rainbow. It's gonna be so tight. Uh, but yeah. Anyway, have a good one.